So here's an example of a house with external insulation being put on it. Unfortunately, it's not being put on that well. So it's only 50 millimeters of standard EPS insulation. And that means it's not going to be very warm, but also they're not putting insulation around the sides of the doors here, and around the sides of the windows. And the insulation you can see at the corners of the windows in some places, it's not actually in an L shape around it. So that means it's much more likely to crack and have splits in the render once the render has been done. And also they're putting quite a bit of render in between where there are gaps in the boards. And unfortunately, that means it's more likely to split as well when that render potentially moves in the future. So there will be some good effect from this. It will warm the house up a bit, but unfortunately it might well look quite bad after a few years with some splits in it. And it won't warm it up as much as it could do if you put 100 millimeters of insulation on and also insulated around the sides of the doors and the sides of the windows.